My name is Phil Mingo. I'm the Head of Information Systems in the Ministry of Education. Um, in the Ministry of Education, the Head of Information Systems would be responsible essentially for all the software, all of the, um, the uh, systems that are developed in the ministry or outside of the ministry. And um, so you would know some things like uh, QuizMe and, and um, the website and application softwares that are used internally to the ministry. Um, we are either developing them, have developed, or uh, we are responsible for supporting them. Uh, Microsoft Teams and so on and so forth. Uh, we will do a lot of training and that sort of thing as well. In terms of um, men in, in, in education, I, I believe that uh, the, the role of those men cannot be um, overemphasized. Specifically, for example, um, let's say for example in teaching, uh, while there are a lot of uh, women or females in education and, and they're very important, I, as a man, young person growing up, I've relied significantly on the, the male teachers that I've seen in my school. And it helped to instill a lot of discipline. While teachers, uh, female teachers, can do the same, um, you would see solemnly men try to be in discipline or young men being in discipline when a man is the teacher. Um, he, he sort of like uh, demand more respect and so on. And so that's something that we've not been seeing very often for whatever reason. Um, so the discipline factor is very important. And, and it's also important for when peer, uh, students um, don't have a man uh, in their home. And so um, it's, a, it's an encouragement for um, men in society to realize that you are significant when it has to do with training up the child and being a part of that teaching process. Don't leave the teaching only for the, the mother or the wife, you know, or the auntie, but you should be a part of it. I've seen, I've seen sometime a documentary where um, some fathers decided to go into a school um, because they would have heard of various fights in those schools. And they dropped, they, they created a team and said they're going to quote unquote police the school just to make sure that um, they're not having those fights. And in terms of, um, they've seen increases in enrollment, decreases in dropouts, decreases in those fights and so on. So I think those are some of the, the, the positives of men being a part of the school and the school system in education in general and, and, and in the lives of, um, of, the, of the students. And, and it's not only whether it's your child, but in the life of any other child, because you may be somebody in your church, you can help that, that you, you can be somebody in your, in, your, in your community and you can show the sort of respect to them so that they can uh, respect others as well. And so for this International Men's Day, well, first of course, I wanna wish you a very happy International Men's Day. I want to encourage men to continue. You have been doing work, right? Uh, so I want to encourage you to continue doing those great work and, um, and stay awesome.